Trump invokes Scott's Borough Boys case in trial request, judge rejects comparison. Hello, valued breaking news subscribers. In a recent turn of events, former President Donald Trump has cited the historic 1931 Scottsboro Boys case while requesting a trial date for his federal election subversion case in April 2026. Trump's legal team argued that this landmark Supreme Court decision illustrates his need for more time to prepare his defense against charges related to his efforts after the 2020 election. However, during a hearing on Monday, U.S. District Judge Tanya Chutkin vehemently rejected the comparison, emphasizing the vast differences between the two cases. The Scottsboro Boys case involved nine black youths wrongly accused of raping two white women, and their trials were marred by extreme haste and lack of due process. Judge Chutkin emphasized that Trump's case is distinct and will begin more than three years after the events of January 6, 2021. The attempt to draw parallels between the cases received sharp criticism both in and out of the courtroom. Retired California Superior Court Judge La Doris Hazard Cordell labeled the comparison as stunningly stupid and alienating, particularly given Judge Chutkin's background. Trump's attorneys referenced the Scottsboro Boys case in their brief, suggesting that defendants deserve adequate time for preparation and counsel. However, Judge Chutkin firmly stated that there's no resemblance between the historic Alabama events and Trump's case. She highlighted that Trump is well represented by experienced attorneys and possesses the necessary resources for an efficient review of evidence. In conclusion, the comparison between the Scottsboro Boys case and Trump's trial request has been rejected by Judge Chutkin. The distinct nature of these cases and Trump's access to competent legal representation set them apart. This serves as a reminder that historical cases must be carefully analyzed before drawing any parallels. Thank you for being a part of the break.